So here we go. Welcome to our coverage of the Biathlon World Championships. I hope you've been with us throughout because it's been a fascinating battle of mind and body. And mind has generally won and lost the competition. So many meltdowns that have cost gold medals. What are we going to see today? On the far side, in yellow and red, Johannes Dingisbo looking for gold number five to equal the record. And uh, will he set the pace early on? Maybe, maybe not. Shoot number four in the stand position and then 3,000 metres to go to decide the final gold medal of these championships. Johannes Tingisbo in yellow trying to make it five golds out of seven races and join Laura Dalma as the only athlete to have walked away from a world with five gold medals. That would, Big be, moment. That would be quite something. I saw Anatoly, the Russian coach, looking anxious. Ziggy, uh, Ziggy Maze looking, there he is, uh, anxious earlier, looking OK now. If the last shoot is anything to go by, Goranichev will take his time. He has to leave first if he's going to win this one. The wind is uh, unkind. That's why they're taking the time. The longer they wait, the harder it is. Then the blind games start and they think, I can lose so much. Gold medal nearly around my neck. I'm beginning to lose the thinking now. The rest of the chasers join them on the firing point. There goes the target. Granachev gets one down. Benedict Doll has one from one. Johannes. Johannes bow. Three misses already. Surely that's the gold number five has gone, but Granachev no. has missed three. Four misses for Johannes Tingisbo. Five, five misses for Johannes Tingisbo. No way. Can he hold on to this one? Watch out for Simonada. He hasn't missed a target so far. He's on 17 out of 17. Is this Austria's chance? No, he's thrown one wide. Petrushny well, with two misses. Christian Tariabo's got a chance, but Simonada one round. He's got one penalty loop to do. Can anyone clear five and move into the gold medal position? Vindish has got a chance for Italy. Well, yes, Whoa. down goes the last one. This is the most incredible race. We've never seen big failure as bad as this. From the top 30 and not only that, Mike, he's got himself a decent lead. 16 seconds, and it's Simonator into the silver medal position. Gigan up behind him, and Johannes Tingisbo has another three penalties to pay. I think Ada is going to struggle to stay in the top three, but Vindish, who was pushing hard on that last lap, has produced a sensation. One win in his career, it was out in Canmore, it was a mass start, so he believes in himself in this head-to-head, -head, but I don't think anyone was expecting that. <laughs> oh, Dominic Vindish well hanging done. on in there. Oh, look at him. And, and the pace that Vindish came around his last uh, four-kilometre track, uh, sorry, three-kilometre track, was like lightning. He came into that range and he rapid-fired those five shots. Gigana still in the silver medal position, but Eberhardt, whose legs are about six inches longer than Giganas, is closing with every stride. But I can't see anyone catching this man now. 15 seconds, the advantage when he came out of the range, and Ada has faded. This is amazing. Vindish has found something incredible. He really felt bad for letting, in his mind, letting the team down yesterday. He missed two targets with each shot. That means he only hit three from eight yesterday. And now today he's come as a different person to, to have payback for letting his relay team down. Guggenha is nearly spent. When those legs have gone, they've gone. It's hard to bring them back. And, and Eberhardt knows that. It's like hunting. He's got him. Yeah, Eberhardt's going to go through like a flash. And Austria moving into the silver medal position. This is going to be Austria's only medal. But you know what? Everyone, everyone is losing time to Dominic Finnish. He's a man on fire. He wants this. He's uh, been told exactly uh, 21 seconds. Uh, he's got ahead of Eberhardt. No glory for the Bow brothers. No podium today. It's uh, going to be a different story. Victory going to Italy. <laughs> Dominic Vindish will join Dorothea Vera on top spot today. He gets himself a gold medal, and that rockets Italy up the uh, medal standings with their second oh, goal. Who's going to get the line? Who's going to get into the lane? Is Guggenheim getting the best option? 
50 meters for Ava Hart to make a charge. It's not going to happen. Giganar has got the limb speed. He takes silver, which is where he started the last lap. Ava Hart gave it everything. 23 seconds down. Yeah.